Welcome back to my channel. Today we're talking about the new Kaleidos lip clays and I do have both new uh, lip colors or packs, sets, rolls uh, with me. So if you want to see swatches of them on my lips, then just keep on watching because we are doing that. If you are new to this channel, hi, my name is Nikki. I absolutely love colorful and fun makeup. And to be honest, I absolutely love Kaleidos makeup. And I ordered the new Vault sets from their Cloud Lab Lip Clays. Um, I did not unpack these because of the on the back side, you do have all the like informations. If when you open this, this is just on the like foil. If when you open this, this is gone. So I was like, okay, before I try to ruin my day and try to figure out which which ones of the set is which, we are going through this uh, again. There are two beautiful and stunning boxes. One is the uh, Cloud Lab Lip Clay Willow Vault, and this is the Polar Placid Vault. Both of them are the same size as the other vaults. Just so you know, I do have all of them just so you know and yeah normally if i open these i will i will show you let me open this again you you heard what i said which which one is which one they are cream to powder lippy light and soft velvety matte uh, lip clays if you are not familiar i will also put in the info box um lip swatch videos of all the other all the other worlds. okay i put them out of their packaging you can tell it's not as shiny anymore. There was a foil again. And then you have a like plank back. And then no, these are really, really pretty. This is a other texture than the other ones. I will show them to you, the other five walls beforehand. But that is another casing. And then you normally can just open that here. And then this is the look of the inside. Again, this is the Polar Placid one. Listen. And this is the inside. And then for the Will-O-Wisp, well, I can't remember that. You can, uh, this is the vault of the uh, Will-O-Wisp. And then these are, again, a little bit another texture and design than the other ones. Again, you can just open it here. And then you, these colors though. And then you have Kaleidos here. And then you have this stunning casing. The others, if you're not familiar, um, I do have five, five of them, and yes, they fit here, by the way. Place them into this. This is like the actual look of these. So at least there will be two vaults. Like, listen, one or two vaults left, but yeah, you can definitely like put them into these. I think that was one of the sets, PR sets, I don't know. The uh, previous vaults uh, looked like this. Uh, this was like just shiny metal and then they had some like raised patterns. And I think all of them were quite the same. Let's talk about Let's talk about these. Uh, again, these are around 36. I will blend in the pricing here. They're around 36 bucks. There are four different uh, lip clays in each of the walls. Again, you can buy them in the walls or you can uh, choose your own vault. They have that for one dollar more. You can uh, like select your tin and then four um, of the like four of the lip clays if you want to. Maybe let's start with the nude collection. This is again the Polar Placid. That will be a mouthful and again it's gone. Which is on one side good because the, you know you can package whatever you want in these. Um, again this is a metal tin and then you just open this. By the way this casing is Going, you can take this out, which is amazing. Let me maybe do some live swatches for you and then we can put them at the end all on my face. Um, let me just pull out again, pull out one. This one is the shade NU9 Pink Himalaya. By the way, the uh, these are stunning. 
I'm, I'm so excited. Uh, these are stunning. And then we have like pink Himalaya. Gorgeous. It is a gorgeous shade, if I tell you. Gorgeous shade, beautiful nude, by the way. Then we do have 10 Tundra, which is, I think, a little bit more. <gasps> yes. Or the yellow one. Absolutely love that. This is Tundra. Definitely tell. This is a little bit different. Then we do have the shade North, which we'll see about that. Ooh, oh yes. That's my shade, girl, girls and boys. This is mine. Like, this is North. This one, it's a little bit more like brownie than Pinky Malaya. This one is, has a little bit more brown. This one has a little bit more yellow. And then the last shade is Echo Valley, which I think was one of the deep shades. Oh yeah, this is a cool tone brown. Be this is beautiful. <gasps> this is Echo Valley. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. And then let me swatch on the other side because that will that will be fun as well. The other world, again, this is the deeper world. This one, this one is the more colorful world. And we find, like start here and then go from here. Let me start with golden resin, which I am the most excited about, to be honest. <gasps> yes, this is a yellow nude. Again, this is my... It's my weekend, so <laughs> golden resin again, gorgeous. Then <laughs> we pull in bloodstone, which probably will be the dark shade. Of course, it is. Uh, again, I'm sorry for swatching on that side, it's not my favorite. I think bloodstone was one of the shades I wished in the um, smoky nostalgia. This is Bloodstone. Again, you can see the difference. This is a gorgeous shade, by the way. So pretty. Then we do have Siren, which I think was the pink. Nope, it was the purple. And then the last one is the pink. These are gorgeous. By the way, I'm sorry for the swatching because this is bad swatching at all. This is, uh, what did I say, Siren. This is the purple. And then we do have the last one, which should be the pink. And this is Rose Fire. Oh, yes. They don't have these, sh like, this, these shades are, like, beautiful. This is the Rose Fire. Yeah, we do have a nude pack and then we do have a more colorfulish pack. Gorgeous. And now let me swatch them and you will see probably a little bit of music in between these because, yeah, we don't need to talk about this, I feel like. And I will talk about if I like them or not and all the good stuff at the end of the day.
Okay, these were all the swatches. Listen, I had so much fun. Formula wise, they are the same than the all the other lip clays. Again, I do have 20 now 28 uh, i did pick out some colors that may or may not could be similar i can tell you one these shades are quite unique like this pink we do have a lot of warm tone pinks but not something like this so this is not a dupe this one as well i did pick out one that is a little bit in that direction and these ones Probably also not. Let's start maybe with Mahogany, which is another brown. And I thought this would be maybe a good, like, swatch. I'm trying to swatch these. Can you tell the difference? This is Mahogany and this is the shade which I forgot a bit. They do look similar. This one is warmer though, just so you know. I'm trying to, yeah, this is way warmer this has a little bit more red just so you know so if you like browns and maybe a little bit of a warmer brown then maybe mahogany and then let's see this one is queen of the night which is a purple and i thought maybe i can show you these purples in the collection are a little bit yeah it's a little bit um deeper and more red you can see this one is queen of the night this one is siren you can definitely tell these are not dupes at all i do have three from the which ones are these smoky nostalgia collection and then all four of the nudes which is the sandcastle collections just so she you just so you know which one you know they could be similar we do have cognac which is a more reddish brown but i also wanted to show you so you can see definitely indefinitely that these browns well i didn't thought that through did i this is again the new shade then we do have mahogany and then this is cognac this one is way more red than uh, the other browns maybe so you can tell then we do have skin ship which hmm this could be maybe yeah this is this is skinship which is really really similar to this shade which i totally forgot which it is i will blend it in but this is skinship uh i will swatch them right beside by the way and then this one is cold smoke which i thought would be yes a more brownish yes listen uh, this is cold smoke. You can definitely tell these ones are probably not the same, but quite. This this one skinship has a little bit more pink, and this one is a little bit deeper and maybe a little bit browner. But listen, if you do have these, you know, this is maybe not the nudes you need in your life. And then we again have four nude shades from the Sandcastle. And I thought I'd swatch all of them uh, to maybe. This is Sienna, which is a more brown. No, this one. Sorry for that. This can go away. Let me just have a sec. So again. This one is Sienna, and you can definitely tell this is a little bit more warm. Is it though like a little bit more warm in yellow, I would say. Then we do have Dune, which is a little bit more cool toned. Yeah, this is a little bit more, like it's a little bit more cool toned pink, but again, quite similar to... I think this one is north, if I'm not mistaken. This one, the shade. Then we do have Terra, which is a little bit more of a yellowy brown. And there I can pull in all of this. This is Terra. And this one is a little bit more orangey nude, if you will. This one is a little bit more like it's like C. This one is quite yellow nude. So if you like that, this is gorgeous. And again, if you love a more orangey nude, this is Terra and this is Tundra, if I'm not mistaken. This one is a little bit more cool toned, a little bit more yellow into that. And then we do have Adobe or Adobe. I know that I'm not sure about it. 
Listen. <laughs> and that is wait, wait, wait. No, wait. Can you tell? I'm I'm horny now. Now you can tell. Listen, this is again a dopey. And it is quite similar to the nudes. You can definitely tell. There are similarities, there are differences. Again, I think especially the uh, quad is more unique than the nudes. The nudes, again, are unique though. This one, again, is cooler than this shade. This one is... It is different. It's not the same nude, but it's not so different that you may need it again i do love tundra uh, north is this one i do love these kind of shades again this is a little bit more brownie and then we do have the shade which i totally forgot which it is this is quite similar but again it's not the same you know what i mean so just keep that in mind if you order again <laughs> uh, so just so you know but yeah these are the colors of all of the new eight uh cloud lab lip clays i hope you liked this video if you do please also don't forget to subscribe to this channel i upload three times a week i do love colliders so i do have a lot of content but i don't also love indie brands i do love makeup tutorials i do love a lot of things pens like all the good things so if you want to see that more in your timeline again i upload three times a week and subscribe and we see us in my next video so bye guys